My room is such a ratchet mess. Like, look at that. I'm literally surrounded by ratchetness. Hi guys, I hope you all had a fabulous July. Um, I know I did, and it's really sad because summer is almost over, but right now I'm just gonna share all my favorites for this month with you and stuff, so let's get started, shall we? Okay, so we're gonna start off with music because if you know me, you know that I am obsessed with my music and in all of my favorites videos, it's basically just like 90% my music favorites. So I actually have a ton this month. So first one is Floats My Boat by Air. And that is just a really great song. I have Other Side um, featuring Fences by Macklemore and Ryan Lewis. Um, Macklemore songs, they usually like give me goosebumps because some of them are just like really like powerful and inspiring and girl this one definitely gives me goosebumps. Um, White Walls also by Macklemore and Ryan Lewis and that's just a really cool song. Chloe which was actually, oh that's by Emblem 3, which was actually one of my favorites like last month but I just kept forgetting to mention it but yeah I'm just obsessed with the song Chloe by Emblem 3 and then how could you not? Best song ever by One Direction. Oh my gosh, like the music video? <sighs> Heart attack. And if you guys didn't know, iTunes has like free songs that they put out every week. And it, it, they're like the picks of the week and you can just redeem two songs for free. I'm pretty sure it's usually two songs. And I found one when I was downloading some music and I actually really, really like it. This was actually the song playing at the beginning of my um, Spain trip video that I just did and I just really love this song. It's called Un Dia de Sol from Los Claxones and it's really cool because part of it's in English and part of it is in Spanish and it's just a really catchy song. Also, if you guys didn't know, I'm a big fan of Taylor Momsen. I love Gossip Girl and I just really, really love her music and I had kind of been a fan of The Pretty Reckless before, but I'd only heard two of their songs. But this month I've really been listening to her music and I've just really loved everything. So I have a lot of songs from her this month. Um, okay, first she came out with her single, Kill Me, which is amazing. Um, I downloaded Miss Nothing, My Medicine, and You, which You is just like the most beautiful song I've ever heard. And I just really love her music so much. So also on our flight to, or actually back from Spain, we had little TV screens. And they're really cool because you can watch movies on them and listen to all this popular music. So when we were flying back to Spain, I decided to listen to some Rihanna. So I listened to her new album, Unapologetic, which is crazy amazing. Like, usually on some albums, it's like they have one or two good songs and the rest are just like, eh. But I listened to the entire album and I was like, oh my gosh. Girl, you got it going on. And also, Selena Gomez came out with her new album, and I am a big fan of Selena Gomez. I love her fashion sense and everything, and she has the most amazing songs. It is just such an incredible album, and I've really enjoyed listening to that for the past couple of days, actually. Kind of off topic, but if you guys want me to do like a what's on my iPod tag, then I will most gladly do it. So tell me if you want me to do that. Um, in the comments and I'll check that out. Alright, now moving on to fashion favorites and stuff. I really don't have a lot, but I just really have been meaning to talk about my sunglasses that I got at Icing. They were having a 2 for 20 sale, which was so cool because <sighs> shit's expensive these days. And I was desperately in need of a new pair of sunglasses because uh, one day, this is a true story, one day I actually sat down on my sunglasses and I broke them. The struggle. So I just picked up these super cute, um, those pairs of sunglasses. The first pair is just a pair of aviators because, I don't know, I think aviators are just the most flattering on me. And, I don't know, I just feel cool when I'm wearing these. So these are actually really greasy and gross. Um, they had a lot of use in Spain, but they just look like this. They have a gold frame, and they have this cute little 
floral print on the sides and these are so cute. And then the other pair is kind of like this cat eye pair of sunglasses that are just black all around. And these actually really help to block out the sun and they look super cute. They kind of remind me of Audrey Hepburn. So those were really useful this month. So next on the list of Erin's fashion favorites, um, I have these black kind of crochet lace, I don't know what you call these, toms, which is actually really weird because I kind of hate toms. But I think that their lace ones are super cute. So I got these for Spain. And I wear these so much. And I can honestly say these are probably the most comfortable shoes I've ever worn. Not only because they're like stretchy and just comfortable. But because like they have a really solid sole. And my feet never sweat in these. Like even wearing tennis shoes or like flats definitely. Like my feet always get sweaty. But like I would wear these for like literally... We could be walking around like 24 hours in Spain and my foot would not sweat a bit. Maybe that's because, maybe that's why it has holes. But these were just so comfortable and just a nice relief for my feet. And uh, lastly for fashion, I have been love, love, loving this Essie nail polish that I actually borrowed from my sister <laughs> without her knowing and it's in the color over the edge and I actually repainted my nails yesterday um, which kinda was a failed attempt. I had like the yin and yang symbols but somehow that just rubbed off but anyway this has just been a really cute color and surprisingly I've never had black nail polish before and so this was like my first time painting my nails black and you know I think I could get used to it. This is just a really pretty um, kinda dark not almost black, shimmery, kind of sparkly color, and it's just great quality nail polish, and I've been loving it so much. If I could choose one nail polish to wear for the rest of my life, I would choose that one. And then for my last favorite, it's actually not related to like any beauty or fashion topic or whatever, but I thought I would mention it because I've really been loving the show Siberia. I'm pretty sure it's on NBC, and basically it's like a reality, sh it's like a show, like a fictional show about a reality show, and it is so good. I've been addicted to it, and it's a little cheesy sometimes, but it's still pretty intense, and I've just been really obsessed with that. So that's it for all my July favorites. I hope you guys liked it. Um, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. You can leave me a comment in the comments, and always be sure to subscribe, and I love you guys so much. Adios!